Warcraft 2 Tides of Darkness takes you to the next level of real-time strategy games as the battle for the kingdoms of Azeroth continue over land, sea, and air. Having formed an alliance with the human nations, elven and dwarven forces join the human armies in a quest to free Azeroth and drive the orcs back through the mystic portal. By taking to the air with strange flying machines, the alliance hopes to turn the tide of the war. Invention and magic combines to create great seagoing vessels to combat the orcish navies and defend the shores of mankind against further invasion. These ships may carry troops or weapons with which to defeat the enemy, and some are rumored to travel beneath the waves. Many new structures have been created to assist in battling the Horde. From the mysterious shack of the gnomish inventor to the majestic aviary that is home of both the great winged beasts and their riders, these sites may prove vital to the ultimate outcome of the campaign ahead. The ever-present basics of society are still essential, though, and prove to support and maintain the way of life that defines the people of Azeroth. Whether it be farms to feed their bodies or churches to feed their souls, the core of human civilization remains amidst the terrible conflict that rages on. The orcs have not rested upon their victories, however, and seek to destroy all traces of humanity. By pressing the trolls and ogres into service, the Horde plans to become the true and final ruler over the whole of Azeroth. The orcish navy is one built on power, Destroyers and juggernauts ride the waves in search of alliant ships to crush under their mighty hulls and devastate with their weaponry. Although some of their ships carry warriors, the orcs prefer to sink enemy ships and then bombard weak coastal towns. From the solitary confines of their scout towers to the massive spires of their strongholds, the hordes have constructed new buildings from which to mount their offensive. These advanced structures, and the support they will offer, should prove to be a constant thorn in the side of the human forces. As peons continue to support the armies by slaving in the forests and mines, the farm and lumber mill remain staples in maintaining any orcish settlement. Weapons will always need making and honing, as will the military. Some things never change. As the augmented forces of the Horde and the Alliance meet in the field of battle, new units will sway the fight in unique and unexpected ways. Support from the skies will play an important part in many confrontations. The seasons and climates will also come into play as the cold of winter cloaks the pitch in its icy embrace. Machines of war and fortified battlements prove to make the contest a careful balance of clever tactics and raw firepower. As the temperature falls, the importance of controlling the sea becomes apparent as vital supply lines are cut short. Not even the bravest of warriors can survive long without fuel for the furnace or gold to raise more farms. As victories amass and your forces roll forward, fully rendered scenes tell the tale of the struggle between the Alliance and the Horde. Whether you achieve great success or fall prey to dismal failure, each aspect is played out in both campaigns. Welcome to the world of Warcraft, a place where even the impossible is achievable and the fantastic becomes reality. Return to the mystic world of Warcraft, where the battle for control of the legendary lands of Azeroth rages on over land, sea, and air. As either evil orc or noble human, you will make powerful new allies, utilize ingenious new weapons, and command awesome new magics in your quest to control the kingdom. Warcraft 2 Tides of Darkness will be released in MS-DOS CD-ROM format. Available Christmas 1995 at most computer and software retail chains nationwide for approximately $50. For more information on Warcraft 2 Tides of Darkness or to order your own copy directly from Blizzard, please call 1-800-953-SNOW. Pax Imperia 2 is the ultimate galactic empire simulator that allows the player complete control over every aspect of a civilization on the verge of space travel. From creating planetary diplomatic policies to amassing an interstellar fleet of starships, the choices are yours. 
Defining the simulation playfield is as simple as choosing a sector of space from the Galactic Overview map. From the number of human and computer controlled players to the types of interstellar nebula, the choices are yours to make, if you so desire. Your computer can also select a completely random universe for your game to take place in. Each sector of the universe is presented through screens that incorporate the latest in information processing technology available in the 26th century. Planetary orbits, ownership, and habitability are instantly available. A closer view of individual planets shows structure types and the current ruling governor. Orders for each planet may be issued and dutifully carried out, or, if left to their own devices, your governors will set their own policies for commerce and diplomacy. An important part of expanding your empire is researching new technologies, from ships' drives, shields, armor, and weapon systems to structural and biological advances, research increases your productivity as well as your ability to defend what is yours and gain what is not. Whether you intend to raise a great war fleet or establish an economic dominion, starships will play a vital role. From carrier-borne fighters and dreadnoughts to fleet tenders and cargo vessels, these ships are your means to controlling the galaxy. Your technicians and admirals will automatically create ship designs for your use based upon your latest research and make them available to you at shipyards. There may be times when, as ruler of your empire, you wish to have ships built to your exact specifications. This is also possible by accessing your computer's full ship design features. Players may decide to utilize computer-generated designs or to create new ones themselves. It is this type of flexibility that makes Pax Imperia 2 easy to control and unique in the genre. Battles are enacted in a rendered holographic simulation field, showing the outcome of conflicts based on players' decisions as to battle tactics, fleet composition, and technological advancements. Pax Imperia 2 transports you into a future where mankind is not alone. With the aid of fully interactive advisors, an intense political and economic system, and the option to use computer-automated or hands-on managing techniques, the galaxy will be yours to command. Control every aspect of a civilization on the verge of entering the vast frontier of space. Economics, research, espionage, exploration, and diplomacy are the tools you'll use to create and maintain your galactic empire. Whether you build a fleet of mighty warships or quietly establish economic dominion, the universe is yours to conquer. Pax Imperia 2 will be released in Windows 95 CD-ROM and Macintosh CD-ROM formats. Available by winter 1996 at most computer and software retail chains nationwide for approximately $50. For more information on Pax Imperia 2 or to order your own copy directly from Blizzard, please call 1-800-953-SNOW. Shattered Nations is a post-Holocaust strategy game in which players must rebuild society from the fires of destruction that have decimated Earth. As the game begins, players find themselves on the shell of a desolate world. Small oases of life are surrounded by vast stretches of wasteland. In these secluded areas, some have banded together in an attempt to survive. As time passes, successful leaders will rediscover old technologies and research new ideas in order to advance their way of life. Players will also be able to investigate new sites into which their expanding population may settle. These destroyed cities, when closely examined, may have older structures that can be renovated. By properly managing resources, Fostering strong alliances with other survivors and maintaining a strong military arm, your society may flourish once again. This, along with advancing technologies, could make for some fantastic and impressive discoveries.
Gameplay in this rich, three-dimensional world is interspersed with amazing rendered story sequences as the players continue their journey to bring unity to these shattered nations. The Earth has become a graveyard for yesterday's aspirations of peace. In order to prevent humanity from perishing, you must maintain the basic resources needed for survival while rebuilding society and bringing unity to these shattered nations. Shattered Nations will be released in Windows 95 CD-ROM format, available by Spring 1996 at most computer and software retail chains nationwide for approximately $50. For more information on Shattered Nations, or to order your own copy directly from Blizzard, please call 1-800-953-SNOW. Diablo is a new role-playing adventure with a dark, gothic setting. Players descend into a sinister underworld filled with mysterious quests, deadly traps, and a terrifying story of supernatural forces and demonic creatures. A rich, three-dimensional world has been created for the player to navigate through. Detailed settings bring the characters and their world to life as the game progresses. The desecrated temple that lies at the outskirts of the village is your gateway into the world of Diablo. The eerie glow that emanates from its abandoned halls invites you into an adventure from which you may never return. A huge subterranean labyrinth awaits. From skeletal warriors to powerful demons of the night, this place is filled with dangerous creatures that have just one purpose, to feast on your living soul. If you live long enough, you may discover what unholy abominations killed your family. Then, the test will truly begin. Diablo, a new role-playing game in which players descend into a sinister underworld filled with supernatural forces and demonic creatures. Integrating intense gameplay with state-of-the-art graphics will place this title in a class of its own. Diablo will be released in Windows 95 CD-ROM format, available by Spring 1996 at most computer and software retail chains nationwide for approximately $50. For more information on Diablo, or to order your own copy directly from Blizzard, please call one 800 953 snow